fucking help me. All right. So it's looking like we got a couple topics today. I'm talking about Boosie has came out. And pretty much I know y'all probably wondering if Boosie ended up ever getting his money from Rod Wave. Because Rod Wave did tell Boosie, hey, listen, Boosie, man, you ain't got to do no type of sum with me. With me, I'm just like, you tell me what the price is. I pull up on you and bring you that money. Just don't hit me with no super overboard price. You know? So Boosie gave an update on that. Did he get it? Did he not get it? You'll find out later. No, he didn't get it. But I'll explain and play the video. He said, uh, but then also, y'all, I'm talking about it looks like the officer... That was actually arrested for the killing of uh, George Floyd. You know, to start the whole "We Can't Breathe." Uh, Derek Chauvin. He's actually been stabbed inside of jail. And when I say stabbed, they said he'd been stabbed so bad uh, that they had to hurry up and rush him to save him so he can survive. Uh, so he has been not critically stabbed, but it, it it was a critical stab, if you get what I'm saying. Not critically conditioned, but it was a critical stab. This could be critical, but anyways, we'll get into both of those. So. Pretty much, uh, we'll start with the uh, Derek Chauvin. It pretty much says, uh, Derek Chauvin, the former Minneapolis police officer convicted of the murdering of George Floyd, was stabbed by another inmate and seriously injured Friday at a federal prison in Arizona. A person familiar with the matter told the Associated Press. The attack happened at the Federal Correctional Institution, Tucson, a medium security prison that has been plagued by security lapses and staffing shortages. Nobody really want to work at the, the prisons, whether it's a private or not and and they short staff so a lot of you know some of my stabbings and a whole lot of other crazy wow stuff that you can never even imagine uh pretty much has been happening anyways so with that being said i'll update y'all see if he survives or not uh they did say that he's in like urgent care so they're trying to like take a lot of good care of him anyway so it looks like Boosie still ain't got his money from Ride Wave. He said, yeah, I talked to Ride Wave, but after I talked to Ride Wave, I told Ride Wave my number. Ride Wave ain't contacting me back yet. But also, there's still a chance that he could hit him back. Obviously, if he don't hit Boosie back, Boosie's going to go ahead and hit up the lawyer. Hey, listen, I got somebody else that needs to do something for me. Hit up the lawyer so he'll be able to get his money. Right now, as far as the Kodak Black goes, because he did say there was a few people that he was going to come after in order to get his content money on top by yg is one uh kodak black is one and of course rod wave is one so he said he gave rod wave the number he wanted but rod wave never hit him back but he still may we'll see but kodak black he said hey i don't talk to kodak black at all now y'all probably already know why he don't talk to kodak black the issues that actually i'm sure there's a video on it somewhere uh but like i say he ain't even thinking about you know asking kodak black to pull up like rod wave said he would do to get the money so he's probably gonna be taking kodak black to court uh but as far as rod wave wait on it and as far as YG. He ain't said nothing else about YG, so maybe they've already had some type of conversation. I'm sure we'll figure that out later. Anyways, here goes the video of Boosie. I mean, I don't, you know, I don't, I don't talk to Kodak. I mean, I don't talk to Kodak, bro. I mean, we just gonna have, have to handle that, you know, handle that shit in court with Kodak. Rod Wade said he gonna pay you. Don't sue him. I talked to Ryan Wade this morning, bro. He ain't pull up yet, but I talked to him this morning, told him, you know, we ain't got to wing it. It ain't got to go there, but, it, you know, I talked to him, told him what I wanted. I'm working with, I ain't trying to break my pocket. I'm a business man. I'm fair game, bro. I just want my little cuss, bro, you know. He said he was going to get back at me. He ain't got back at me yet. I mean, that was earlier this morning, so hopefully he'll get at me tomorrow. I've been hitting him up tonight. Now, after that video, I'm sure y'all can see uh, Boosie's doing what Boosie do. You know what I'm talking about? Boosie always about trying to get his paper, trying to get his money. And, and now he's finally taking actions into the courts. You know what I'm talking about? Into, into like litigation type of stuff in order to get his money. Pretty much what Boosie's doing is not nothing that's abnormal that people do inside of the music industry. It's just the fact that most rappers don't actually do it for themselves because they have a whole label that's actually taking care of all that stuff from them. But Boosie's label, obviously, 
if he's even signed to a major, who knows? It might be independent, all the stuff that he be doing and saying. And, and how, you know, he got his own independent movie company. He make movies, BoosieMovie.com. I always telling people to get that. That's another source of income for him. So, uh, like, what are you doing? He's just collecting those who have used any type of thing that, that you know, not his trademark, but, like, his copyright, pretty much. Copyright. Uh, and, and what he may popularize and other people's, you know, making replicas of it. Now, there may be some type of litigation as far as if he copyrighted it or if he trademarked it or if he, I don't know which I have to figure that out. That's just a deeper section in the music, and uh, we can get into that another day. But anyways, we'll just have to see how it all goes with Boosie and also how it all goes with Derek Chauvin if he'll survive and if Boosie will get his money. Let me know something. Dude, hold on. Do y'all think Boosie's going to get his money or do y'all think Boosie might be wasting his time. Anyways, let me know some. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about this entire ordeal. I'm out.